Hey guys, my name is Olaf and in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to make a very basic drivers setup for wheels in Blender. So uh, let's get started. Okay, so before I start the actual tutorial I'm just going to show you how to enable auto execution for your Python scripts. We're just going to run the um, drivers. And I'm going to start this tutorial with a wheel that I downloaded from the internet. So uh, if you don't have a wheel, you can see the link in the description and get this exact wheel, which you can rotate on the uh, x-axis. Okay, so let's start adding drivers. I'm going to click N to uh, make the coordinate show up. And then I need to go to the top because I enabled screencast. And then right click on the rotation and click add drivers and single from target because we're only going to rotate it on the um, x-axis. Then select the x-rotation. Before I start adding drivers, I'm going to add another object, which is going to be an empty. So click Shift A to add an empty, and then add the uh, cube one. And then I'm going to scale it and grab it a little bit on the different axis. Click S to scale, G set to grab it on the set axis. And then click S set to scale it down on the uh, set axis. Then click GX to grab it on the x-axis, x and then SY again to scale it on the um, y-axis. And then I'm going to grab it on the z-axis, and then I'm going to uh, select the wheel, and let's start adding the drivers. And to edit the drivers, we need to go into the graph editor, and then switch from F-curve to drivers. And then we need to uh, select the uh, X rotation and click N to uh, go to the drivers. So the second one. And we need to change the object in the properties from um, this one to the empty. So click here and then click empty. And then switch to transform channel. And then we're going to select the type and make it uh, Y location so that when we uh, move the empty on the uh, Y location the wheel is going to rotate on the um, X axis. And if we now select the empty and grab it on the Y axis we're going to see that the wheel rotates but it rotates in the wrong direction. So we need to make the uh, variable a negative so uh, make a minus or write a minus before the variable and that is going to reverse the animation so um, I'm just going to duplicate the wheel and then I'm going to duplicate both of these so let's just delete this one and make two of them so holding shift to select two uh, objects at the same time and I click Shift D again to duplicate. What you're going to see now is that when we um, set these um, wheels parent to the empty, so by adding drivers to the wheels and then setting them uh, parent to the empty, you're going to get this animation when you grab it on the y-axis. Obviously, this driver setup is not very it's not very advanced, so you can't really rotate it in any way, and it's only going to work on the y-axis. But if you want more advanced tutorials about drivers, you can just leave a comment. And if you have any questions, just leave them in the comments as well. And thank you guys for watching.